Planet Dolan. From why goats have horns to the history of toy dolls, we answer some of your most burning questions about life. Hey there, my name is Melissa. I'll be reading out the questions and answers. I'm Danger Dolan, and I'm here to blow your mind with truth. Killer Blue Gaming asks, do white holes exist? How can a hole be made of white? How do you dig a color? Surely you understand that colors can't be dug into. I mean, no one's that stupid. I mean, at least you didn't ask if something even more ridiculous exists like a wormhole or a black hole. Come on. White holes are hypothetically possible. They spit out energy instead of storing it. But we don't know if they exist. If they did, they can't be entered from the outside. But it's completely possible for matter and light to escape. Hey, Melissa. You want to see my dirt hole? You know that it's just called a hole. But then why is it called a butthole? Uh, why is your butt emitting quantum energy? Ugh, I guess white holes are real. CDV010 asks, why do goats have horns? Back in the old days, the most magnificent of all creatures was the unicorn. But everyone wanted them to be even more special. So we stuck another horn on with super glue. This did the opposite though, and now they're mostly lame. Their eyes are still cool though. Goats, and most other animals that have horns or claws, have them in order to defend themselves, gain mating rights, and to show off to the opposite sex. If you ever see a goat without horns, it's because its owners decided to remove them. No horns? Way to make them completely lame. What have you got against goats? They stole my Game Boy and saved over my Pokemon save. That's literally impossible. Yeah. L look at him! Look! How do you explain that? Christy Bellatio asks, Why does chocolate make you thirsty sometimes? You must be doing something wrong. Whenever I eat chocolate, it has absolutely no side effects. You're obviously eating it wrong. Did you take the wrapper off first? Wait, don't tell me you eat with your mouth like a nooblet! It's because sugar requires water in order for your body to process. Your body then sends a signal to your brain asking for more water. It could also just be that you were low in saliva and the chocolate soaked it up, making your mouth dry as well as making you feel thirsty. Zombie Slave asks, what's the history behind toy dolls? An icky girl made one back in 1999 and they've been super popular ever since. I don't get it. Dolls aren't nearly as cool as this action figure of Mr. Mega Amazing that helps me sleep at night. The earliest dolls we know that were used for playing are ancient Greek articulated dolls from 200 BC. Jenny Stolp asks, what is a tardigade? There are evil insects that eat all the magic in the world, leaving almost none left for us. But on the plus side, they left over the super awesome power of being able to escape to other realities when we sleep. That's right, your dreams are real. Anything is possible. Look at the paint! It's drying in another reality. Tardigades are microscopic arachnids that are arguably the toughest animal to kill on Earth. They can survive outer space, intense radiation, very low and very high temperatures, as well as atmospheric pressures 1,200 times that of the Earth. Tyrone Townsend asks, if the asteroid that killed dinosaurs never hit, what do you think technology would be today? Dinosaurs are super vain, so they would just spend all their time making the bestest selfie making device of all time. It would have 10 million intersaur filters, and all phones would only have a front facing camera that would always be taking the most flattering photos physically possible. Assuming the dinosaurs evolved to be intelligent, technology would focus more on their physiology. It would have to artificially produce intense heat in cold and dark climates as reptiles can't keep their blood warm without help. Which is why there are currently no reptiles on Antarctica. I can never bring myself to take a selfie. Why not? They're fun and educational too. I don't think I look good in photos. It's all about the angles. Check this baby out. Yeah, that's right. Sexy! Holden Iverson asks, are we all related? I don't know about you, but I've had the sneaking suspicion that this is true. But when I asked my mum, grandma, cousin, dad, she said that it's ridiculous. But then again, she lied to me when she said most normal people have noses. 
Not that I'm jealous or anything. If we went back a thousand years, the required amount of people to all have separate ancestors would be over 500 billion ancestors in just one generation. So it's impossible for us to not all be related, though very, very distantly. If a cow laughs, does milk come out of their nose? Don't be silly, cows never drink milk. They drink the brand new Dolanade. It's the radical new drink that all the cool cows drink. Just look at this cow! It's on a skateboard! It's so cool! Now with 20% less sugar, fat, salt, and cow pee. Only three types of animals have something that's like a laugh. Dogs, apes, and rats. Cows don't really seem to have a sense of humor, but you can tickle them. Some farmers use this if they ever need some pee to send to a vet for testing. Say Dolanade! Say it! Bulls can't talk, Dolan. Bye, Dolanade! James Abbott Couture asks, Will we collide with another galaxy? You know how we randomly have daylight savings and a leap year in February sometimes? That's another galaxy colliding with ours. The space-time fluctuation causes us to print a new calendar every year because of all the new white holes and Dolanade whizzing through the galaxy. Yes, with the Andromeda galaxy. But don't worry, it won't happen for billions of years. The crazy thing is, is that it's entirely possible and probable for our sun and its planets to come out of the collision unharmed, since space is so empty that most stars will never touch each other, and the majority of the collision is action at a distance thanks to gravity. More importantly, will planet Dolan be okay? It'll be okay. Our planet is just a drawing on a computer. Nothing bad can happen to the internet. Uh, you're right, I forgot. We've actually got Norton security installed. Nah, everything will be fine. Kit Kat Kelsey asks, is color just an illusion? Actually, color is the only thing that isn't an illusion. That's why paint will never ever come out of your clothes or your perfectly good white hat that may or may not be the only piece of clothing that you own. Color is a very real aspect of reality. It's just different wavelengths of light, but we can't see all the colors like infrared, ultraviolet, radio waves, etc. Interestingly enough, magenta isn't actually on the spectrum of light. It's just made up by our brains. Why don't you just get some white paint? Because you can't just go and mix your paints. I saw what happened at Vietnam. Anyway, that's it. Thanks for watching. Have a good one! Hope you guys enjoyed the episode. There's another link on the screen currently for another episode made by Return of the Goo if you want to go check that out. Also, Shima Shirts! Shima Shirts down below, Shima Shirt store, go check it out, get your own Shima Shirt, Shima Shirt!